Did you know that hope, and the degree to which you experience hope, is the single greatest predictor of your future well-being? Hopeful people do three things. They see a bright future ahead of them, they can find pathways to that bright future, and they can handle any obstacles and frustrations that get in their way as they walk that path. The Hope Champions Network in Omaha is creating a community where everyone experiences hope. My name is Scott Butler. I'm the Senior Director of Prevention and Early Intervention at Project Harmony, which is the child advocacy center that serves the greater Omaha area. That spans eastern Nebraska, parts of eastern Nebraska, and 16 counties in southwest Iowa. Our story actually started in 2015. A group of local community leaders came together concerned about the impact that trauma was having on families in our community. They were mostly concerned that many of the professionals working with those families weren't making the connection between the, the experiences of their clients and traumatic stress. These leaders called for a multi-phase initiative through which we would make Omaha a truly trauma-informed community. Phase one called for training a tipping point of people that could spot and understand trauma. As a child advocacy center, our staff work with families experiencing trauma every day. So we decided to take the lead on the training goal. Fast forward to 2022. We were beginning to merge into a sense of normal following the COVID-19 pandemic, and we did the math. We realized that to that date, we had trained over 30,000 people, well in advance of the 22,000 that were called for by that goal. Phase two of the work asked the question, now that we can spot trauma and understand it, what do we do about it? especially in a community that doesn't always have enough of the traditional resources needed to address mental health issues. And we have a large population of historically underserved people who often face significant obstacles in accessing those traditional supports. We found our answer in hope. The research is clear. Hope is the number one predictor of well-being. Kids who experience hope have better school attendance, they have higher academic achievement, better health outcomes, and they're more engaged in school and community activities. Research is also clear that when we teach skills related to hope science to kids experiencing traumatic stress, we can mitigate the long-term impact of adverse childhood experiences. Gallup Organization, also located in Omaha, has been measuring hope in young people since their inaugural uh, Gallup Student Engagement Poll in 2009. Since that date, they've been telling us consistently that while hope is the number one predictor of future well-being, fewer than half of our nation's youth are hopeful. Our Hope Champions Network is changing those statistics. We launched in May of 2023. The Hope Champions Network is a train-the-trainer model that equips people to be hope champions. Hope champions are people who can look at their work that they're doing through a lens of hope science. They can identify where they're building hope and where they're ripping it down. And they can identify ways to further infuse hope science into the work they're doing. Our champions are also trained to deliver eight hours of professional development to anyone in their sphere of influence on the topic of trauma and hope. While our initial focus was on one local school district, demand quickly grew. We now have over 200 hope champions who span from upstate New York to Las Vegas, Nevada. They represent a wide range of professions, including educators, law enforcement, mental health practitioners, faith community leaders, those working with homeless populations, medical providers, and those working in rural communities that often lack access to traditional health services. Our champions have already trained over 1,000 people in their own spheres of influence. And following their training, 97% of them report believing that Implementing hope science in their work can have a profoundly positive impact on their community. Most importantly, we don't just teach hope science, we practice it. So when we think about the future, we see communities of hope. Our pathway to that bright future is creating hope champions across all sectors of the community. And we'll overcome the obstacles and frustrations we encounter on the way through the collaborative efforts of our hope champions. Please join us in being hope champions.